Welcome to a brand new episode of Popcorn, Coffee, and Joysticks. I'm your host, H.B. Gibson. First and foremost, I want to thank all of you, especially my recent subscribers, for all of your patience and support. It is greatly appreciated. I know it's been a while since I've put up any gaming content. I'm trying to get it together. You know how life goes. And starting with this episode, we're going to be introducing you to a brand new segment. A special series, if you will, called Games from the Crypt. Crypt. You like that, huh? Now, why do I call it Games from the Crypt? Well, there are a lot of horror games that are out there that have been out for quite a while that I just discovered. So nine times out of ten, the horror games that you're going to see me play, you probably already saw somebody else play. But I never played them. Now, before we go into today's game, you know what time it is. If you're watching this episode, if you're a subscriber to this channel, you are automatically my Karateka Warriors. And what do our Karateka Warriors do? Fighting stats. Tice! Breathe, focus, and dragon! That like button, hit subscribe, hit that bell icon, so that way you get notifications of brand new content. And now here we go. Our very first game in this series, Games from the Crypt. While looking up some short form horror games, I ran into a game called Ex Mortis 2. And I started to play it and I said, wait a minute, where's Ex Mortis 1? Well, I finally found it and it was on Newgrounds.com. Ex Mortis was originally released on Newgrounds.com on August 27th, 2004 by Leffler Web Design. It is a point-and-click horror adventure with lots of jump scares, and uh, yours truly is going to play it. Don't forget to check out the Popcorn, Coffee, and Joysticks audio podcast, where I will be reviewing Five Nights at Freddy's. Link is in the description below. Okay, so without further ado, let's get scary. Okay, everyone, here we go. Ex Mortis, let's do it. Leffler Web Design presents. Oh! Yeah. Whoa. Now, I read somewhere that some of those pop ups, those, those, uh, jump scare pictures are actual pictures of you know death things like real death (gasps) oh you wake up in the woods with a lump on your head you can't remember how you got there all you can recall are the dreams it's late cold and you are unsure of where you are exactly Fighting through the headache, you regain your focus. You see a house in a clearing and decide to shelter there. Anything is better than freezing to death in the woods. Oh, Lordy Lord. The woods. Well, looks pretty woodsy to me. Okay, so I'm supposed to be waiting for something? Oh, this is a point and click after all. We're going inside. It is freaky. Okay, press the lever. Wow. Whoa. Okay. These stairs lead up to a second level. Uh, let's try here.
Yeah, it's pretty dark down there. Look, look, look at this. Dark hallway. What is this? Cellar entrance. Uh, the handle turns, but... Whoa. Okay. The handle turns, but the door refuses to budge. It's almost like someone's holding it closed. All right. I guess we're going to go back, right? Let's go. Uh, let's see. Shall we go down the hallway? I think we shall. Let's see. What's this? This door seems to be locked. Grandfather clock is ticking away in the corner. And of course, you got symbols here. Uh, you know, th th these are definitely part of some kind of a puzzle. Definitely. Okay, so let's let's go over here. Oh, the noise. Okay. It's time to time to start searching for stuff. Whoa, a trail of blood leads under this door. Hmm. All right. Let's see. Anything in there? Nope. Close it. Hold. Cupboard seems to be empty. Whoa, what's this? A knife sits on the shelf. Whoa. Now that's a knife. That's a knife. <laughs> Anybody see Crocodile Dundee? <laughs> that's not a knife. That's a knife. <laughs> so, okay, stained blood knife. You should probably arm yourself with a slightly larger weapon. Okay. Put it back. Okay. Empty. Okay, why is it... There's blood dripping from this microwave, and I'm afraid to open it. The microwave, and there seems to be blood dripping out of it. <laughs> Duh. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one, clicking. That. Ah! Woo! A severed head. It appears to be a fresh kill. Wherever the killer is, he will probably be back soon, and I don't want to be here when he returns. I don't think we want to be here either. Okay, so. What's on a... Well, you know in these games we got to inspect stuff, so. Lord, oh, Lord. That's an A, huh? You know what? I think we need to start taking notes. I have a feeling we're going to need to take some notes. Um, Do I have a pen? Okay, I'll just have to rely on memory. Okay, there's an A there. That's... My gosh. Whoa. Creepy. Okay, we're going to go to the next door. What the heck? Whoa. What is... Okay, this man, man. There's nothing of interest on this table. Blood stains the chair. Okay. Nothing... A tattered diary sits on the table. You really think I'm going to read all this? <laughs> nah, I didn't really read all that. <laughs> There's nothing here? Nothing there? What's this? What's that? Is there anything here? Okay. All right, let's go. Let's get out of here. Uh, say the... Okay, that is still locked. Let's go in here. Uh, let's go here. Back into the hotel. I hear you talking, but I don't know what you're saying. Okay, so we're going to go upstairs. Let's do the window. 
What is that? Is there something over here? Or is there something over there? Left or right? Let's go this way. Okay. Door has no handle. Okay. Let's go back. Okay, let's go let's go right. What is this? Oh. Whoa, dude. You um yeah. Okay, something went knock knock knock. What the heck? What? There's no breeze here. So why is the roof lamp swinging? The bedspread is soaked in someone's blood. The gramophone is unplugged, but it's still rotating. How is that possible? Painting on the wall. Let's see. Okay, it doesn't work. Okay, so let's just start clicking around. Start clicking around. What? Hello. What is this? Ah. That means somewhere in this house is a code. A combination to open up this safe. Okay. <laughs> All right. So the blood is coming from up on it. Then there must be a way to get upstairs. Is there a way to get upstairs? Bathroom. Dirty sink. Bathroom this seems to be filled with blood. Key. Ah, a key. Hmm. Anything here? All right. Uh, There's a jump scare that's going to happen. I know it. I know it. Ugh, that sound. Okay, so let's. Uh, Say, you're. There's a thump, thump, thump. Where's it coming from? Wait a minute, is that a. A hatch in the roof might lead to an. Okay, I think we're about to get our first jump scare, I think. Uh, here we go. Whoa, hello. I don't like that noise. Oh, goodness. What is a symbol written in the blood of this poor soul? Yeah, a poor soul. Okay, you know what? That kind of looks like one of the symbols on the clock. I wonder if it has anything to do with anything. And the torso hung up by the arms and ripped to shreds. You wretch at the sight. Let's see, is there anything here? Anything there? What's it? Is it? There appears to be something scrawled onto this plank. Oh, I mean, just just make it easy for me, guys. Okay, so this is okay. So I'm I'm assuming that this is the code for the for the uh, safe downstairs. Three four eight nine. Okay, three four eight nine. I have a horrible memory. Three four eight nine, and there's a little F thing. Three four eight nine. Three four eight nine. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Is this? Okay. So it was three four eight nine. Three four three four eight nine. Access code. Well, hey. Whoa. There appears to be a human heart. Then that, that's a. This, whoa, a strange symbol is smeared in blood on the safe wall. Uh oh. Uh oh. We got some satanic stuff going on here. Okay, let's. Uh, definitely some satanic stuff going on here. Ex mortis. Okay, am I really going to read all this? I'm sorry, y'all, but I, I, I mean, you know, what will be, you know, prophecy. Okay. 
is, is this oh my is this the boss am I gonna be fighting this thing <laughs> Xavier okay okay so we got that symbol we had an A symbol and before it was like that F this kind of looks like an F too but the other one seems to be more closed this one has like a symbol and two dots here okay all right so let's let's roll let's just go let's get out of here all right so and over there i think over there was the was the door that can't open so we're going to go down here and go back here let's see if we can see if we can go back to that that door next to the grandfather clock oh oh yeah 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 gotcha 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 i gotcha i gotcha yeah okay yeah you guys do a lot of talking <laughs> a lot of convo that i do not understand okay so let's okay it opened up the door Whoa. Hmm. Oh, yo. There's something very unnerving about this sculpture. Yeah, yeah, it just looked at me. Let's see, bookshelves. Huh, so I'm assuming that if I, let me, let's click around. Click around, click, click. Whoa, is that a hand? A severed arm. This house is turning out to be a graveyard. Yeah, no, no poopy. Is there anything here? Is that a sim? Hmm. Something has been written in blood. Oh, another symbol. So I, I, all these symbols... Uh, well, you know. I mean, like, if you ever played Resident Evil or played any of the games that has, like... Uh, puzzles and everything all these symbols is leading up to something so let me i we had like that a symbol on that head then we had that f looking symbol in the attic and then we have that other f looking symbol but w with the two dots it's like an upside down l actually and we have a u with a line drawn in it so that's uh let's see how let me see that's about like how many are those what was it a, uh, the the F symbol, the F symbol with the two dots, and this. So, I don't know. I hope it's not a whole lot of, a whole lot of uh, puzzles I got up on. Let's see what the, do, 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 do. hey, look at that. Okay. Oh, yeah, we got the upside down A. Is it? Do these things do anything? I'm clicking on them. It doesn't do anything. It says, it says A B C D E F, A B C D E, F G, H I. Let's see. Okay, so. Oh, okay, 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 okay. A. So that thing is upside down A. It's probably upside downy. So. It looked like an A, but I think it was upside down. So A, because he looked like a U. It looked like a U. Uh, a, that F looking thing, that other F looking thing. So we got A, uh, so we got A, the F looking thing, the F looking thing. And was there something else? I'm not sure. All right. Anyway. Okay. I am almost convinced that there is something else in here that I need to read. So we have to look around. What? I'll be doggone. Look at that. <laughs> Xavier. I'm not reading all that, man. 
I'm not reading all that, man. I'm not reading all that, man. I'm not reading all that, man. Maybe one of these days I'll go back and... No, I won't. <laughs> okay, so let's try going over here. So we found the book. Oh! So I had to read that book in order for me to... Oh, I had to pick it up or, any, or whatever, you know, to, in order for me to get here. So, huh. Children laughing, that's never a good thing. So here comes the problem my jump scare now. Here we go. What? Well, hello there, young lady. Hi there. Shall we click on the ghost? Ah! Okay. Maybe we weren't supposed to do Wake that. Up. Wake up. Oh, okay. Wake up. <laughs> Hello. Gwen's bedroom. What's in here? Gwen, the blood of Gwen Raham. Raham stains the sheets. It was over 100 years ago that she was murdered. So how can the blood still be wet? Goodness, I have no clue. Is there anything here? Is there anything? What's that? What's that? What's that? What's that? What's that? Anything up under the bed? There's nothing up under the bed. There's nothing here. Okay. Let us go this way. And uh, is there anything that I, I anything else I need? Uh, I don't think I need that. So go down there. Okay, so let's go down here. Maybe we can go in here now. Maybe. Ah, no weird noises. Hello there. Whoa. Okay, an old air filtration unit, but the duct runs away from the actual house. Well, oh, hello. An axe. I shall ask you later. Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hello. This part of the wall has been boarded up. Look at that. <laughs> Yowza. What the heck? The old tunnel stretches into the darkness. What is going on here? Is there anything I need to worry about? I think that what's going on here? I'll kill you, you son of a bitch. What? Ah! Hey! A symbol appears on the forehead. <laughs> oh, this is the fifth sacrifice. I'm not one of the five campers. Then who am I? I can't be. Please, no. Okay, so we have that symbol. We got that A symbol and some other weird. So, okay, so severed hand. <laughs> oh my goodness, what's going on? Okay, we get for, further in, further in. Small hole in the wall. Hey! A key! I got a key, okay. Alright, so I guess we go back. I bet you this is from... 
I, I bet you that key is for that door on the side. Is that it? Okay. What do we have here? Oh, oh. Welcome back, child. You have served us well up until this point. Now serve us again. Become the hand of Ex Mortis. Become the hand of Ex Mortis. Devour the crimson life of five. Marks of power given unto thee. Mirror below the cells of mine. What was, what is, and what will be. You, you know what? Let's go in the order of what how we found everything. Uh, a was on the head. Uh, this F thing was on the uh, was upstairs. This little funky thing. Uh, here. And this funky thing here. And here. Nope. That wasn't it. Okay, so. A. Shoot. Uh. that one no, no 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 wait nah A was what we found first right and then the last one so what was it so was it boom 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 or was it boom 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 four hours later I Finally! Wow! Hmm. Wow. Oh! Well done! Look at that. Ex Mortis Cult lures many. A Leffler web design project. I, I, this was good. I like the atmosphere uh, for a point and click. It, I really, really like the atmosphere. A lot of these point and clicks that I've been doing it has been really, really wonderful. Um, it's wonderful gameplay. Wow. <laughs> Look at that! I'm, oh man, all the work that went—it went into this thing is amazing. So, so now I can actually—oh, influenced by various movies such as Evil Dead, Poltergeist, and Hellraiser. Okay, I guess we can go on ahead and play uh, Ex Mortis 2, right? Stay tuned for that one. I'm H.P. Gibson. Thank you for watching Popcorn, Coffee, and Joysticks. And next time we will play Ex Mortis 2. Play again for an alternate ending? Hmm. Welcome back, child. You have served us well up until this point. 
our servants again. Become the hand of its mortars. Devour the crimson life of Thorai. Marks of war are given to thee. Military cells will perish beyond the void was, what is, and what will be. What's in here? <laughs> wow. <laughs> you failed to escape the tunnels in time. Okay. <laughs> Try again. Push <laughs> back. <laughs> I did it. Or did I? I don't know. It did. <laughs> A well used to track that a well used track that leads back to civilization. You can finally return to the world you have been kept from for so long. Oh <laughs> Not exactly, right? <laughs> that's an alternate ending or not but we're gonna leave it here okay <laughs> all right see you next time on popcorn coffee and joysticks uh. don't forget to check out my interview with suna in the interview we talk about my voiceover career and how i got the role as the watcher in a paraphobia click on the video link on the upper right hand corner of your screen who I am is who I be. My last name is Gibson, initial HB. God up above, Rouge Rose got my back. I'm playing scary games while you watch me react. Shout out to Torture Star Video and Puppet Combo. Combo. Combo.